Fit with Fox is sponsored by Gold's Gym. Eight fourteen. Baseball season is now in full gear, so grab your bat and swing for the fences. This morning's Get Fit with Fox is centered around America's favorite pastime fitness expert, Patty Butcham of Gold's Gym, joining us now. And you look like you're ready for some ball. I am ready, or at least I'm going to get ready with these workouts. Okay. Right? I was watching everything from opening day, and I thought, okay, let's do a baseball workout. Um, so I'm actually going to work out with my bat first, hitting oh, my do core. Do I move? I feel like I'm I'm not going to be swinging to Today, but okay. if I start, that's when you want to run. <laughs> so I'm going to get down on my mat here, and this is actually for my core. I'm holding this up um, overhead, and I'm bringing my feet up to touch this. So this is engaging my core here, Got and it. I can also do single leg as well for that to make it a little bit harder, right? And that's all core. That is my core right okay. there that's being targeted. Now, another thing that I can do for my core that also helps with my upper body as well and that coordination, I'm gonna take, it's a softball, I'm not gonna lie, but I'll take my baseball here and I am gonna do a push-up variation where I am grabbing that ball and moving it to the other side, doing a push-up, grabbing it, moving it to the other side and doing a push-up. So this is working on my coordination a little bit. It's also hitting my chest with that movement from side to side too. Now, what you can also do is swap this out for a weight okay. too, if you don't Ooh, have, that, if you really want to take things up a notch, challenge. right? Yeah. Oh, definitely. Another thing that I can do as well, um, talking about hitting our legs here, I'm actually going to do a kneeling squat. So this is coming behind my um, head right here. And I'm doing the same movement that I would in a squat, but I'm doing it from my knees. Is that as effective? Because when I do those, I feel like, whoo, I got to rest from my regular squats. I kind of feel like I'm cheating because I don't feel it as you don't feel it quite as well if you don't feel it quite as much you could switch up by adding more weight or no, something no, like no. that now the reason that I like to do those as opposed to my regular squats is it's so important to switch up that exercise right. variation right but you are getting uh, you're getting the same I am effect from I that. am and okay. if you're somebody that has maybe hip or IT band problems yeah. this could be helpful for you as well if you can't go all the way down that squat try it from your knees yeah. with a baseball yeah. bat or on the squat rack, whichever you prefer. <laughs> but you know, if you're out with the kids playing baseball, you can get your workout in. Just throw something else in there. Very good. All right, so what are we going to see next from you? Next, I'm actually going to use this to stretch, and I'm going to use those balls for some myofascial release as well. So if you're feeling sore, the next part is for you. All right. And it's, it's a good time to get outside and actually do some of these instead of being indoors in the gym. If you can. Box is sponsored by Gold's Gym. Nine twenty-three, batter up! Fitness expert Patty Buttram from Gold's Gym is back, demonstrating some full-body workouts that fit right in with this baseball season. We saw some exercises last time. Now we need to do some stretching to yes. work out all the muscles that we've just been exercising. So we're still going to use our bat. To we do that. still are. We're still using the bat, and those balls are going to come into play as okay. well. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is work on spinal health, spinal mobility, all that good stuff. So important, right? So I'm going to work on my shoulders a little bit and the upper part of my spine. These are progressive exercises, too. So as I'm doing these stretches, I'm gonna progressively push my body just a little bit further each mm -hmm. time. So if something feels uncomfortable to you, go ahead and stop right there and just work through the stretch where it is. Now if it feels easy and your body can stretch further, that's when you add something else. So I'm doing some shoulder rotation here, right? Um, just really stretching out everything in oh, my that pectoral just muscles. Looks really good. I always want to stretch. It feels so it good. I almost don't even want to stop. But something else that I can do to help with that spinal mobility as well is I'm flipping this right behind me, right? And I'm gonna press it against my rib cage, and I'm rotating. So oh. I'm gonna rotate, mm -hmm. and then I'm also gonna tilt laterally. So this is actually stretching out my core mm -hmm. and my obliques here, my abdomen. This feels so good. It you looks can, like it does. Yes, and you can do <laughs> static and dynamic stretches like this. So static, you would uh, you know tilt and hold that pose there. The dynamic is when you're pulsing or moving back okay. and forth, right? Now, one of my personal favorites, if I've had a long workout or a long day sitting you know at my desk mm -hmm. at my computer, right? I use tennis balls or soft balls to actually roll out whatever muscle hurts. Um, particularly, you know, if I've been sitting down, those shoulder muscles and up top near my cervical spine get really 
really sore. So you can just take your softball, baseball, tennis ball, whatever you have, and just gently roll it onto that muscle there. You can also do this lying down as well. You're going to feel your body the dig yeah, when oh, you do that. Yep, yep. And it may be a little bit tender, so you're looking for um, a tender feeling but not pain. I just lost one, but don't worry. I got a second. Um, you don't want it to hurt, but you, you may yeah. feel a little bit of tenderness and pain as you do this here. And you can also roll out your IT band and your glutes that way as well, whether standing mm -hmm. or down on the ground as well. Um, and I will encourage everybody to incorporate these in their day-to-day -day routine, right? Get up a couple minutes early, stretch out, or you're hitting the baseball field. Whether you're stretch. working out that day or not, stretching yes. is, yeah. Yes, stretch roll out, it's gonna save you in the long run from having to recuperate from an injury. Take it from her, this is very true. All right, thank you, Patty. Yes. The Nationwide Media